and to stop the spread of coronavirus, the county is now going to require the grocery store workers, pharmacy workers, that they wear masks when they are interacting with the public. Our Natalia Holmes spoke to one store owner that says not going to be a problem. They're already doing that. Workers at grocery stores and pharmacies will have to start covering up their nose and mouth. I spoke with one of the owners at Steely Farms Market, and he tells me he understands the importance of his employees wearing masks. You know, this is a little stopgap measure to help you know, slow things down and so that we can still provide a good service to, uh, to the community. So um, it, it wasn't a big scramble. It, yeah, some people are going to have to think out of the box on how to get there, but as business owners, we think out of the box every day. Noel Steely says his employees have been using masks for nearly a week now in an effort to keep everyone safe. Plexiglass was put up near the cashier stations to enforce social distancing between customers and employees. Steely says the community has also stepped in a great deal. Customers have started making masks for employees. Health experts say people don't always show symptoms even though they may carry the virus. Masks will protect those around them. There have been some cases of grocery store workers testing positive for COVID-19 around the county. The county is not mandating the general public to cover their nose and mouths, but it is highly suggested. In Kensington, Nate Holmes, 10 News.